Hey guys, I want to do a quick video. Um, I'm doing my oil change, and I posted a short video on the oil kiss count on 3.6. It was my buddy's gladiator that works with me. Um, so he checked at a thousand miles, and it was almost full. So what we figured out was he's running 37 on 17 inch uh, rims, but he never did the gear ratio change to make it a little easier on the transmission of the motor. So what it's doing is keeping the RPMs high, so it's creating more of a bypass or a blow by, you can say, for the burnt oil going through. So I'm gonna put the video on this um, at the end of this one, or maybe in the beginning, I don't know yet. So you guys can see it, this is a, a quick one, how much oil actually came out. So I ordered one for my wife's car. She has a 300 with a 36 that we're going to to my son. And of course, you know, the beast right here, or, Frankenstein, everybody's calling it, um, has two. The driver's side really doesn't do anything, and the passenger side is right there. I, I got it out drying, come cleaning it. So I just wanted to let you guys know I'm trying some new stuff. Some Royal Purple came out. I don't know when it came out, but I just found it because I was doing some research. And of course, you guys know I use the zinc in all my motors. And I run the SRT filter, which is actually on a Viper. The reason why I run this is, you guys can see the check valve in there, so it keeps the pressure built up so you don't have that hard cold start. So, just want to let you guys update, you know, everything's going good. I'm still waiting on the tune on this. Um, we're trying to figure out why we're having issues. We're having issues with the Diablo computer. It does not like the HP tune that we're putting on there, so my map sensor is um, not reading properly. What you guys know, I went to the new style map sensor, which is a 3.2. Uh, bar so this is a 18 and newer Hellcat Durango Demon etc map sensor so um, that's about it for right now I'm gonna do another video because I got some new toys in as you guys can see this is a zero camber rear knuckle for the car that I'm gonna try to install this weekend uh, this is a direct connection product, so you can only order it through a direct connect dealership. I can get it, but it's a little bit more money because I got to pay shipping and cost from another dealership. So, hopefully, you got this video is informative to you. Uh, let me know what, what all the new stuff you guys use. Let me know how you like it. Um, I was using Mobile One before, so I'm going to give Royal Purple a shot, see how it does. Um, like always, thanks for watching. All right, guys, we're doing a quick video on that work. This is one of my coworkers. is a Jeep Gladiator that's jacked up super loose, as you see. So he installed an oil catch can from the JNL, which was J JLT, and that's how much came out of it out a thousand miles. Oh, nice. So, so you guys know it's definitely worth it. A little more than on the car on the 36 than I expected. Because mine doesn't go that high, but we'll see. Got any questions? Let me know.